In this section of the tutorial, I will show you how to automate lip sync in SFM with Motion Editor. Our first step is to create a reusable face animation of a character opening their mouth, closing, and some idle animation like breathing, blinking, and frowning. The animation should look a bit like a person saying the word no, so we can later save it, copy paste it over a voice line, and create a decent outlines of lip sync in the future. I will speed this part up because I already recorded a detailed tutorial about motion editor. This is how the finished animation should look. We can and should create many versions, if we plan to use a character many times in the future. Now let's export the animation. I recommend putting it in user mod slash animations. Personally, I also export the head movement of the character. During the lip syncing process, it can be useful for shots without much movement. Now, for the practical application, let's import our animation into a scene that needs lip sync. Copy nearly the entire selection, but begin the tween on the frame at which the mouth begins opening. Now, crudely copy paste this animation on the entire timeline, loosely syncing it with the voice line. What? What if? What if? What if? What if? motion we created this animation in one minute but it's not good enough for final production use let me introduce the most useful motion editor selection for cleaning lip sync the 2x4 smooth tween this is how i refined the previously made choppy dialogue animation if needed When you linger on a frame where the pose doesn't match the voice line, align the tween and tweak the flex controls. Just move the two by four selection we made along the timeline until you are happy with the final result. The quality of the data that Motion Editor can create can match the graph editor. Now, I will just copy the upper face and eye section along the timeline like before. Before I summarize, here's the finished animation. What if uh, you lined up eight cylinders, connected that to a crankshaft, each cylinder pulled in air and fuel with a piston, and upon compression, you transferred reciprocating motion into rotational motion. This process is especially helpful for Hardware Morphs characters. This week I will expand the animation tier on Patreon with a folder of such animations.